So recently I had this conversation with a classmate of mine and it was like, you know, somehow it's like I needed to hear the words or I needed someone to say those things to me. It was a quite motivating conversation. So basically he was talking about how discipline is so important in whatever we do. We have to be disciplined, like, you know, day in, day out, put in the work even if you're lazy or not and this and that's something that I have been struggling with being disciplined in my work and in my things like you know I, I, I have been consistent and it's a battle that I like that I must fight and win that's something that reminded me too yeah oh yeah that's like you know what I need to do like I'm not being consistent in my vlogging or in my videos or and it's like I'm kinda losing faith I was kinda losing faith in myself and happy place shut up and I was feeling doubtful and I was uh, constantly thinking is this worth it like what like should I be doing something else you know these questions but and it's mostly because of like you know self-doubt judgment to myself with by myself and yeah like fear fear of failure fear of things like that i think everyone goes through these things especially like you know when you feel when you don't know if you're doing the right thing or if you're on the right path so yeah i have been going through these things mentally and trying to figure out my life but we cannot figure out our life I think we just have to go with the flow and do our best try our best and do what makes if we can do what makes us like at least little happy or things like that so yeah so I'm just going to be can try to be I will try my best to be consistent and just you know do what I like to do make vlogs make videos for be free because Sometimes it gets very like you know competitive or it gets very like stressful that you know it becomes about the views and the likes and all that shit. So when that gets to your head, it's like you know you get you I procrastinate a lot. That makes me not work or not make any videos because I want it to be perfect and then I am like afraid of the results. So like that leads me to procrastination and that was like my setback that's something that was holding me back and i know that and i'm trying i was trying to overcome it myself and it's like it's a mental battle you know you have to fight these things in your own and i think once we get over the fear of like fear of failure, failure fear, fear of disappointment, fear of these things like this all with this doubt so I think we have to fight that we have to get over it we have to just be okay with you know be okay with whatever just not care and just keep doing it keep going keep going keep going so yeah and also like that conversation with this classmate of mine was like you know he was talking about how you know how vlogging like you know being a youtuber or an influencer like on the platform is actually very like it's a good it's a good thing it's not bad and mostly sometimes i also doubt like you know i used to have this self kind of self doubt or that self judgment that oh my god like like a, as if being an influencer is a bad thing or like it's something that i should be ashamed of i used to have that little doubt in me and also I used to think, oh, people will think I'm so useless, people will think I'm, you know, wasting my time doing this shit. Like, I used to have that. So that is also one of the reasons why it's like, I was doubtful of what I'm doing or if I should do it or not. Or if I should try something new or do something, go in another direction. But having a conversation with this classmate of mine, it kind of like opened up a new perspective of seeing things from another point of view also because mostly like when I come across people be it like relatives or like you know people who I know so 
the narrative they have of like influencers or social media is always negative okay and they would tell me also oh social media is so negative people are so you know i don't know what uh, young people are wasting their time being influencers like they would literally tell me while they know that i have a youtube and i do this like for now right and it was very demotivating like people like that who used to kind of like i mean they also have a point okay but everything has size right everything ha it has a good and a bad so I, those people used to kind of like drain me and make me doubt myself more but this conversation with this classmate of mine actually made me feel like hmm like you know made me look at myself or like the work i'm doing on social media like just this vlogging and all that in a good way and it made me a little proud or like gave me how can i say that encouragement to keep doing it you know and yes i should not rely on other people i should not rely on what they say and what they know that's also another form of like you know people pleasing not people pleasing but it's like i don't rely on people to do my to base my actions on if they say it's good i'll do if they say it's bad i'll do but we are all humans you know we get influenced by what people say but it's good that you know i'm very grateful that i had that conversation because after that i was like hmm i think i see a i see a future i see something that i can do like this journey me being on youtube or me just putting my life out there on the internet can be something can be a journey that is self motivating and it's like a journey where i can dedicate my life or myself to improvement to like you know because that's something i really really like like i'm passionate about is to make myself better get better at things or just like you know keep growing keep getting better like you know there's always so much to learn so much to do but recently like i said i have been stagnating and this stagnant feeling has like been feel like it's like i know i should be doing more i know i should be thing and my mind keeps telling me but i don't and that's like oh like you know i i've been in this cycle so now it's like i am slowly slowly bringing these changes into my life and i want to also vlog it i want to capture it so that you know i see the progress and if you are someone who also wants to get better at something or just achieve go for something and you are feeling stagnant or you feel like oh i don't know if i can do it or not it's normal you know it's like so normal to doubt yourself and all but as long as you don't give up that's the main important like don't give up it's this thing is you know you can be doing anything you can be studying you can be Uh, working or you can be like creating it's it applies to everyone like as long as you don't give up on yourself just believe in yourself like have uh, blind faith not blind faith is it called it's like you know you have to be delusional to a point like you know it's it's stupid but at least you have that faith so strong so people might think you're crazy but just do it man you never know what's possible so yeah that's something i am i was reminded of and it's like it's like it was like a wake up call and i needed that like we all want to get better right like or sometimes we don't want to get better we're just okay with what we have and all yeah that's also like at least it makes you happy but this feeling like you know that itch inside you or that annoying voice when you don't do anything and you know you can do better and you know that you were made for more or you can do thing and it'll keep eating it'll keep nagging at you until and unless you do it you do what's you better you don't think about me what do you talk about you <laughs> what a narcissist he thinks i'm talking about her you know so yeah so that's like something we have to do uh something we have to it's like your something inner you it's like you have to work. grow It's like your your mind, your body, everything is telling oh, you hello. get It's better, grow, grow. Like if you yeah, stagnate, if you do not grow, oh. and it'll inside of you will feel uncomfortable, get okay, angry, madam. things yes. until you make a change. And they say if you want to change your life, you must change first change your yourself. Self. Oh my God! If you're not happy with your life, life. how do you oh, think you're going to change it? Change, change your daily routine, 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 change your habits. Ekwa jilu checking with. Kiba. Kiba. Okay, just ek bar 
Jindu she is acting crazy. Yeah. So yeah, guys, I woke up early today. So she's acting. So I feel right. quite motivated. You know, I feel like a feel I can rule this. I can own this mm-hmm. world. That's why I feel like I can wake up, conquer oh, this. That's world. why whoever wakes up early has the you know the uh, the the power to put everyone Change. down. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they're like, oh, you, I'm better than you. Yeah. I woke up at five. Yeah, you, know? you woke up at eight. Ew. Yeah. So basically, yeah. If you can wake you up in the morning, you just you just ahead a step ahead of everyone. You know, yeah. I'm so today I woke up at five thirty, guys. But it's not like I want to wake up every day. So you know, stop again. but it's so inconsistent. Sometimes my dog will wake me up. They want to shit. They'll wake me up at five thirty. Sometimes six. Sometimes seven. Oh my god! And they are my alarm clock. They wake me up better than my alarm clock. If my alarm clock rings, I will snooze that shit. But if my dogs wake me up, I can't snooze because they have to do the business, you know, and I have to take them. And it's my responsibility as a dog owner. It's my. You should take how they wake you up. Happy literally yeah. pushes me like this. Uh-huh. My dog literally like does this, and then she'll pick. She'll put her <laughs> face inside my hand, and then like she'll, pick oh. it up. So, like she literally push me. Yeah, so I'll show you guys next time how my dog wakes me. That, but I have to sleep with the camera. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, so I want to wake up early in the morning, conquer the day, and act over smart. And act over smart. Act like you know, I'm something. Like I'm doing something right in life. Yeah. Even if you're not doing anything, if you wake up early, that's ten yeah, points that's for you. Yeah, that's ten points. And especially like to your parent, to your parents. My mom will be very happy. Like you know, okay. Before I used to kind of have this discipline. I used to ha- have the routine. I used to like work out. And all. But you know, things are always not like this. Things always don't improve. You know, sometimes there's shit. Like you know, there's downhill. Sometimes things go wrong. But as long as you come back up, you know, you decide to not like. Even though life is not always like this, okay. So it's like this. Sometimes bad things will happen. Sometimes you'll, you'll break your routine. Sometimes this that. So I have been. Feeling like this, so now I have to go back up, you know. And I want to record that. I want to make a vlog about that. I want to like take the how can I say like a nonsense. <laughs> so just you know, like use this as an opportunity to grow, to get better, and also to encourage you guys if you're also feeling like that. I'll vlog. So I'll try to wake up early. I'll do some exercise. I'll walk ten thousand steps daily. No one's stopping you. Do it. Maybe. <laughs> no one is stopping me, but I'm stopping myself. The biggest obstacle is not people. It's me. That's yeah, the thing. So it's like you're gosh, the problem. <laughs> I'm the problem. Okay, so that's my challenge for this. This my vlogs. They're not doing so good. But still, I will not give up. I'll keep making videos. I don't care, even if there's so less views. Because you like it. Yeah, because I like to do it, and I don't want like the, you know, the statistics, views, counts, like to matter I mean, to affect that's, me. That's but how it, you started. That's how you. St- yeah, like you know, it, and it affects people. It's normal, you know. It's so normal to be affected. But I don't want it to affect me anymore. So that's something I have to fight. That something I have to. It is an obstacle that I have to overcome. So yeah, I'll keep doing that. And okay, let's chop this. Mm. So yeah, thumbs up. If you want to be on this journey with me, on this growth journey to get better. Growth. Growth. Oh, I thought growth. So let's like do growth. it. Growth. Oh yeah, good journey. Also, greatest, <laughs> greatest of all time. Let's be on this good journey. Can you uh like uh, this thing that? If you, you want a, if you want a dope life, <laughs> you gotta do you dope sound like shit. A loser rappers. <laughs> so yeah, if you want a dope life, you gotta do dope shit. You know, I want a oh, dope life, oh, so oh. I'm gonna do dope shit. Oh, I know. <laughs> what? <laughs> the, uh, you know who you are. <laughs> so guys, let's do this. Okay, now I have to go. I have to write up. Uh, I have to make a presentation mm-hmm. with Achila. Mm-hmm. For a presentation, I'm gonna give in the speech, in the speech, sorry, in the in the in the stage, and then I'm going to become better version of myself. And I will imagine we'll record this. Again. 
Like we'll record the process. Good. Then I have become better. <laughs> Come. Then I have been suffering from what? From fatness. Like how will I end this? By talking in the mic and be like, bye. Okay.